Well, Elliot, Lauren, we heard so much all week about all those early voting numbers, the millions of people around the country, the state and the county getting their votes cast early. Well, this is the result. Quiet lines here in West Miami-Dade. We've seen a few people trickle in and out, just a handful, some coming with their kids, whether it's after work or after school. But really, now is the time to get those votes in if you're one of these people who do it last minute with just a few hours left because the wait time is minimal. Now, in Dade County, of course, we've seen about 90,000 votes cast today. They expect that number uh, for the entire election cycle to eclipse a million for the county. Now, so many early voters, quiet or early voters, we've seen these quiet polling places, uh, not just here, but we were also in uh, Liberty City this afternoon where the Miami Marlins were actually out there handing out meals to people who did their civic duty. Now, we spoke to some voters throughout the day. Some said they're excited to have this whole election cycle uh, be done with. They have a little bit of election fatigue. Others say they haven't voted in years and are happy to have their voices heard. I'm actually kind of tired of, of hearing about it, so I just right. want to move forward and whoever ends up being the president, uh, I'm yeah. okay with. To be honest, the last election I did not vote, Yeah. Uh, but I think it's important because, uh, you know, there's, uh, there's things going on that, um, you know, we, we might need a change, we might not, but uh, people need to exercise their opinion. So once again, you can vote until 7 o'clock tonight. The wait right now isn't long. Now, if you still have your mail-in ballot, you can drop them off up until 7 p.m. That's tonight at the Elections Department, the Stephen P. Clark Government Center, North Dade and South Dade Regional Libraries as well. But remember, it is 4.03 right now, so just under three hours left to get your vote out and taken. Here at Miami-Dade, Mike Cunha, CBS4 News.